When questioned, the memorized officials blamed the accident on the improper use of the memory-saving technology by a Chinese company that didn't own a legal license to operate large-scale memory copying. The memorized press release stated that the appalling consequences of a technological deterioration and use uh, and used the opportunity to reassure users that its source products were completely safe. I don't know why I added that in there. Whatever. Uh, what the Nanjing HP4 case does prove is that catastrophic memory accidents are possible. Despite their reassuring press releases, Memorize is risking the mental health of the global population in ways that could have terrible consequences for us all. Contrary to what the company would like us to believe, Memorize is not a philanthropic enterprise, but an extremely powerful multinational that has as the most extensive and insidious intel on data mining and individual profiling imaginable. It is now time to remember. Apparently only a thousand people remembered and 52,000 people forgot, but most people don't even give a shit about this. It still seems pretty hidden even though that uh, was saying that people can't forget. No idea. Something about Memorize and some woman holding a brain. I'm sure someone uh, can translate French, but it isn't me. So, I have no idea where it is that we, uh, we missed something. But there's definitely something we missed somewhere. And we can't go back according to her earlier, so I guess we're not going to worry about it, wherever it might be. Damn. That is one hell of a skyscraper over there. Thought maybe I could jump onto that, but no. Finally, the leaking brain. I thought it was a leaky brain rather than leaking. Whatever. I can't go over here? Come on. There's stuff over here. I don't believe it. Happy hour 24-7. It's always happy hour. saw that. I think this might be indicating the thing that I saw while we were scooting on over here. Which is right here. Hey, we got a fifth sat patch. This adds an extra health chunk for us. Very cool. Nice new heart container. I'll eat your damn heart if you don't quit blubbing, you Someone gave Johnny my name. <laughs> See headache Tommy over there, but I don't care yet. Trade with a smile, same thing we saw earlier. Like to see if there's anything else around here. Is it? I guess. Pretty, but you're not my style. Okay. I could really care less. Bob, shut up! I guess we just need to talk to uh, Tommy Boy over here. It has slowed me down suddenly. Laughing in the dark. Johnny wants my heart for Christmas. You, you know that, huh, Tommy? You're safe here, Bob. Don't sweat it. Whoopee! Bitch did it. <laughs> Come here, sweetheart. Neilan. Seems like a lifetime. 
I'm sorry. I have no memory of you. You really can't remember this pretty boy face of mine? I'm sorry. Hell. Well, we all lost bits and pieces in the war. But you're free, sweetheart. That's what counts. I guess. Feels like I'm lost. First things first, sister. Let's get you out of those straps. But I kind of like the outfit. Ogle, I presume? That glove over there? It's yours. I rescued it from your safe house, along with your fancy combat skin. Lucky thing they caught you on a day off. Now this... is a hundred percent Nilin. Way above the model I used to use. Beyond me, sister. You're the only one who can use it. What did they do to you? Down there. In La Bastille. Unlike you, I had to stay for the whole program. Well then, let's get you changed. Your combat skin is in the locker. Sedova. The bounty hunter? Is she dangerous? Determined. She'll turn the slum inside out to catch you. Not just to catch you. Typical brain rat. Barely outside and already working. Dylan? Dylan! This is for you, David. He makes memory. This memorial transfusion has a good chance of healing your husband, Mrs. Sedova. Shared happy memories have an extremely positive impact on patients. The syndrome that your husband suffers from is a classic. Excessive memorial deletions, acute dependency on external mnemonic triggers. I did risk of identity. Short, the inevitable shattering of already fragmented personality. Here, these endorphins should lubricate the process and help ease his receptivity to the transfusion. Come on, David. Remember us. Remember yourself. Memorial transfusion complete. <laughs> Don't worry. NMP is the best hospital for the treatment of memorial 
afflictions. Everything will be all right with time. Yes, of course. Ah, good. The initial results are encouraging. We need to schedule more treatments. A great deal more. It's an extremely expensive process. Continue, Dr. Quaid. I can cover his treatment. So, the whole reason that she's hunting me is apparently because uh, she needs money to help her husband, who looks like he's turning into one of the slum things that attacked me. And now I'm supposed to make the doctor kill David Sedova instead of curing him, and therefore make her not want to hunt me. Wow, that seems like a really awful thing to do to Olga, just to protect myself. I like that her knife said memorize on it, though. That was kind of amusing. The first step is to find memory glitches that you can interact with. Rotate backward until you find a memory glitch. You can hold left mouse button to rewind faster. Okay. So, like this. Memory limit. Please rewind. What's this? It looks like a glitch to me. This is, uh, interesting. You're approaching a memory glitch. So you rotate backwards slower and slower and right mouse button to stop on the glitch. Okay. Where is this? Strap. Unlock it. Okay. Is the best hospital for the treatment of Memorial afflictions. Everything will be all right with time. Yes, of course. Ah, good. The initial results are encouraging. We need to schedule more treatments. A great deal more. It's an extremely expensive process. Continue, Dr. Quaid. I can cover his treatment. That doesn't seem to have really done, done anything. Only unlocking the strap was not enough to reach our objective. Okay. Now find the right combination of memory glitches to make Dr. Quaid kill David. Huh. Okay, well, this is, uh, this is interesting. Alright, rewinding through the strap unlocking. Strap unlock memory glitch will cancel the interaction. You can track activated memory glitches at the bottom left of the screen. Here's the memory. Interesting. Complete. What's this? I can untie a mask. You are. It hurts. David, you are going to get better. Olga, so empty. So true. Try to remember us, David. Our first time. You'll come back. I'm guessing I need to unstrap him so he's going to attack the doctor and probably uh, cause some issues here. 
David, you must come back. <clears throat> Don't worry. Anemphia is the best hospital for the treatment of memorial afflictions. Guess I need more than that. Will be all right. Not quite enough. <laughs> this is very interesting, though. Oop. There was more. I wonder how far back I can go. Okay, that's as far back as I can go. So I can just this is for you, grab David. the memory glitches along the way. This memorial transfusion has a good chance of healing your husband, Mrs. Sedova. Share your happy memories have an extremely positive impact on patients. The syndrome that your husband suffers from is a classic. Excessive memorial deletions, acute dependency on exterior mnemonic triggers. Capsule switch. Aggravated risk of floating identity. And a trolley. Oh, so he's got a weapon or something? Possibly so the doctor has the weapon available. Short. The inevitable shattering. Ping machine. So, I wonder if I really have to activate all of this, or if I'm only supposed to activate a few of these, because it was talking about a combination, which um, makes this a little difficult if I'm only supposed to do a few. Fragmented personality. That's different. Here. These endorphins should lubricate the process. Bet you that's more like adrenaline or something. Memory flux. Memorial flux inversion. In progress. Help ease his receptivity to the transfusion. Doctor, he's pouring into me. Stop him! Mrs. Sadova? Collapse of donor identity imminent. I think I may have killed her instead by accident. Converting the memory transfusion has killed Olga. This is called a memory bug, as you can't remember that you're dead. Can you? <laughs> this is really neat. I do like it, but at the same time, it's like you can't really do everything or you screw it up even further. But I, I, like, I like the fact that there's multiple things you can see along the way. However, I can see that this is probably going to end up taking a long time if this kind of thing happens a lot. Alright, let's undo this. Memorial. Help ease his receptivity to the transfusion. Augai. What is what is Augai exactly? Oh. Uh. 